Hi everyone, this is Kalyan Kumar and welcome to another unboxing and review in Product Review. High blood pressure can prove fatal if not treated on time, but the problem is most of the time they act like a silent killer. With no obvious signs, it gives people less time to react when diagnosed with hypertension or high BP. If you are old and prone to high or low BP, you should definitely keep a monitoring device at home to keep a regular check on your vitals. Now I've been suffering from high blood pressure for the last 10 years. Though for the first 8 of those I never really bothered to check my BP regularly and that coupled with a sedentary lifestyle led me to contract heart disease. Now I check my BP regularly at least once a day in the morning. Recently I misplaced my BP machine and so I decided to buy another one. This time rather than go to a pharmacy and buy any random machine I decided to do some research. This led me to buy Dr. Trust Smart Blood Pressure Monitor. This video is about its unboxing, key features, hands-on review of this product and what made me choose this one. So first let's look into the box. The front and back of the box are similar and display the picture of the device along with some important features. One of the sides gives details about its specifications and detailed features. The other side talks about how to use it and the WHO indications. Now this product is manufactured by Nureka Inc. USA and is distributed in India by Nectar Biopharma Private Limited. Since the BP machine must be accurate, it should be tested, validated and approved by uh, the health nodal agencies. This monitor is ISO certified, FDA approved and is also approved by European Conformity. This is a very important thing to check before buying a BP machine. In India especially, there are many local machines which are way cheaper but are not accurate devices as they are not certified by the health department. And when I bought this in Amazon.in, this set me back by around Rs. 1700. Now let's look at the unboxing. When we open the box, we first find a feedback form. Then we get a Dr. Trust digital thermometer, which is a free product with this device. Inflatable arm conical cuffs. Four AA non-rechargeable batteries. And now we get the device wrapped in a plastic cover instead of a pouch. And we also get the user manual. The device can also be powered by a standard micro USB to USB A cable, which of course is not included in this. Now let's look at the device. The device is lightweight, so easy to carry and is made up of high grade plastic. As you can notice, it is completely black and has a large LCD screen with its patented zebra lights display that makes it look premium. It has two ports, one for attaching the airflow tube of the conical cuff to the device and the other is the micro USB port. The advantage of this model is that you don't have a typical uh, pin adapter for which you would need an AC outlet. Instead, just connect any micro USB cable of your smartphone to it and the other end to any USB power device like a laptop or even a power bank. Alternatively, you can power it by also using the 4 AA non-rechargeable batteries which are provided. There are three buttons on the device. In the middle, you have the power button. The M button is for memory and the device can store up to a total of 120 measurements of systolic and diastolic blood pressure along with pulse rate with date and time for two user groups meaning you can keep the memory stored with details of your BP and pulse for two different people and total number of entries of, uh, allowed are 120. 
keep pressing the M to go back to the previous readings. So no need to write down the measurements with you. The clock button is to set the date and time. Now this needs to be set only once, but would be required to be done again if the batteries die or are removed. And let's see how to use this function. The highlighting feature of this device is that it comes with the irregular heartbeat detection, advanced fuzzy algorithm for accurate and immediate display of the blood pressure and dual talking function. This has a high measurement accuracy, reliability and usability. To use this, first place the conical cuff on your hand. Though it doesn't really matter which arm you use, it is preferred that you use the left arm for the cuffs. And this will also additionally help you place the cuffs properly with your stronger right hand in case you are a right hander. Make sure that the cuff is placed on the naked arm and not on top of clothing and avoid placing this on clothing as much as possible. First bring the end of the cuff inside the metal hook to form a loop. Now insert your arm inside the loop such that the bottom part of the cuff stays 1 or 2 cm above the elbow. Make sure that the air tube is pointing downwards towards your arm. Now wrap the cuff as tightly as possible. The cuff has a size of 22 to 42 cm circumference which fits almost all people. Now insert the tube into the tube vent port of the monitor. Press the start button after making sure that the device has the required power or the batteries are inserted. The device automatically inflates and deflates measuring the blood pressure. The device will display the systolic pressure on top, which is the pressure when the heart is contracting and the diastolic pressure at the bottom, which is the pressure when the heart is relaxing. Along with this, you will be notified about the pulse rate. Apart from the display, you have the option of allowing the monitor to speak the values in English or Hindi, or you can even mute the voice preferences. 180 millimeters of mercury, diastolic. 113 millimeters of mercury, heart rate 80 beats per minute. According to the World Health Organization guidelines, your blood pressure is shown strong hypertension. To do this, press and hold the power button for 3 seconds. It will take you to the language option. By pressing the M button, you can toggle between the default English or Hindi or mute. Hindi. There is a colored strip on the device. If the indicator is at green, your BP is optimal or normal. If the indicator is in the yellow zone, your BP is elevated. And if it is in the red zone, the BP is high. And in my case, it almost stays high. So that brings me to the end of this video. I really hope you found this useful and this video will go a long way in your choice of monitoring your blood pressure regularly and the choice of the product. As stated in the disclaimer, this is not a review product and that I bought this product with my own funds and no one is sponsoring this video and no one is reviewing the contents of this video before it is uploaded. If you like this video, then do please hit the thumbs up button. This channel is about unboxings, reviews and tech concepts. So go ahead and watch some of my other videos of this channel and if you find them to be useful and interesting then please do subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to activate notifications for any videos that I post in this channel in the future. This is Kalyan Kumar signing off. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye and thank you for watching.